3030 surface profile measuring system. Soon after powering up, load the sample on the stage approximately in the center. This is a manual sample holder. It needs to be operated only manually. And lower the stylus tower using this knob until you see a fine image of the sample a well focused image and press the stylus down button three times in order to lower the stylus and adjust the stage to locate close to the area where the profile measurement is to be taken. Press the stylus up down button to lift it up. Verify the program, press the video key to see the graphics. The video key has three operations, graphics only, video only, or video plus graphics, both. Use the down button to select the item from the program and make changes if necessary 750 micrometers and press enter follow the instructions in the manual for changing the program select the profile right one, either a crest, trough, or bolt. In the measurement range, select 655 kilo angstroms, mid-range. Works all the time. And by selecting display range into auto mode, the display will be adjusted depending on the profile height. This is reference cursor position and measurement cursor position. These two positions are to be selected on either side of the step height and the stylus force. Selected about 20 milligrams. In the Tech Tech 3030 menu, the program and key sequence menu exists. Press enter to select any menu item. Press program to go back to the main screen. And in the system setup, press enter. The printer type that is included with this machine is OmniPrint. 40 and the printer is connected using the ribbon cable.
I'm running a scan using the scan button. Use the zoom knob if you need to zoom on the video image. profile, raw data, we can start leveling the profile, press reference button, move the reference cursor using the left and right arrows and measure button, locate it on either side of the step and then press level and then zero. To replot the profile with the new boundaries, press left key and move the left side and the right. And use the top and the bottom key and Click on replot. This is a 9600 angstrom standard. Locate the measurement cursor and reference cursor on either side of the step. And by clicking maximum height is 9633 angstroms. measure the average height between the cursors, locate the measurement cursor and reference cursor in the step area and press average height. It's about 9608 angstroms. In order to print the profile, turn on the printer and it's a thermal printer. Press print button. The data on the screen will be printed on the thermal print. Okay. The system is shipped with a plexi glass cover to hold the stylus. This cover needs should never be removed. Uh, just pull the yellow paper clip holding the stylus in up position or down position and then take the, the black cover off. There are four screws on this plate. And in order to load the sample holder First, turn the, the slotted screw here all the way clockwise and once after loading the stage you have to rotate it counterclockwise. So to enable to load the stage, rotate it clockwise. Hold the stage and make sure there's no particles on the Teflon pads and install the stage on the glass slab and slide it in and there is a flag. Make sure the flag sees the opto isolator, optical switch, rotate the screw. Counterclockwise. 
and that latches the stage. The stage should not move after loading it. Put the dust shovel to prevent Dust reaching the slab and latch the stitch. Place any sample on the stage. Move the stage. Power on the stage after powering it on. The stage will start sliding all the way to the back and wait till it stops. Lower the stylus head till you see the patterns pattern on the wafer or the sample. In case the pattern is not focused, adjust the final objective lens on the micro on the camera side. Only if necessary. The X knob moves the pattern up and down and the Y knob moves the pattern left and right. 